they're trying to open up a safe that they probably stole, but... No, don't mind me. Keep going. Ooh, I don't like the way that you guys are talking, but I'm gonna just, you know, mind my business and keep on walking, you know? You feel me? Mm-hmm. All right, I gotta see what they're doing. Okay, why don't you just show the damn lock and be done with it? And have it bounce off and hit me? You don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> you really can go at it all day? Turn too old to spend it would be nice. I don't see you doing nothing except talking all manner of crap. Hey, I got the safe. And I outran the sheriff in the wagon. I'm getting real sick of you right about now. Oh, save for me. Quiet now. <laughs> Oh yes, See? look at that. I told you. Huh. Well, it took you long enough. Jesus. Yeah. Oh, what do we got here? Hmm, yes, sir. Oh, whiskey's on you. Oh, look at that. That's so cool. I'm not gonna kill them. They found that safe, so screw it. Is there anything for me, or should I not be that hopeful? Nah, it's okay. Lover of ladies here, like my video, share my video, leave your comments below because I just love talking to you guys. But most importantly, please subscribe to my channel, that way you'll be able to get daily gaming content. And hit that notification button as well, so you know when I upload my videos. Oh gosh, it's Dutch again. Honestly, I'm just... You know, I'm actually pretty... Pretty hysterical at the fact that we got played at the train station. Like, well, I wouldn't say the train station per se, but... We definitely got played because of the fact that the Italian man said that we were able to get mad money... And we got, what, 15 bucks? Give me a break here. This guy set us up for real. He did it on purpose. It, it was obvious. Alright, I gotta change my clothes because, well, I want to put on something else, so. Let me see here. What should I do? Hmm. Look at all these outfits here. I say we can do... Uh, I'll do this one. Why not? Nothing like a good old classic outfit here. All right, let me see what Dutch wants. I bet he has another scheme to get back at the mayor for how dirty he did us. Hello, Dutch. I'm here at your beck and call. Oh, Arthur, you get the deciding vote. Oh, goody. Oh, uh we take an insult and scurry off like cockroaches? Or deal with business the right way? We don't need to take revenge. We hardly know the guy. This ain't about revenge, Hosea. Angelo Bronte don't mean shit to me. This is about the fact we are planning to rob a bank in his town. A bank that he no doubt protects. A town where his men are gunning for us. Before we do that, we need to put him I out of commission. I disagree. There's always an easier way. Like what? Like what, way. Hosea? His type. He is a vindictive little power broker who rules by fear. Now, we pull that stunt in his cesspit of a town. We're doomed. You want to leave this place? Leave this country? We need that money. I just don't feel good, Dutch. This is it. This is the last job that we are ever going to pull. Before the year is out, we are going to be harvesting mangoes in Tahiti. Look at his fantasy. That is so we cute. We need seed capital, and we need to leave. You know it. I know it. Forgive me if I can't think too much about the mango harvest. This is I'm... it. Trust me. Arthur. If it's business, well, business is business. Angelo Bronte stands between us and our future. You'll damn us all. Hasn't he already, though? Come on. You better be right about this one. Hosea, he already has. What's the difference? I've heard that before. 
And usually I've been right. Uh, if you say so. Quit doubting, Arthur. It does no favors. Come on. We need to go see a man about a boat. Dutch, if you're the one that's planning, of course I'm going to have lots of doubts. Based off your history alone, your plans suck. They always fail, and it has plot holes bigger than Twilight, basically. We survived the trolley station, so he'll be expecting some kind of reprisal. All right. Okay, makes sense. See? I do still possess some capacity for rational thought, Arthur. Oh, wow. You could have fooled me, Dutch. You could have fooled me. Come on, Bendejo. Let's okay, go. Follow me. Yeah, yeah. I mean, this is a really nice place to be in compared to the right. other areas Boy, we've been cooped up in. My side back there. It ain't about sides. Hey. Feels like Jose has lost his spine. This move on Bronte. Is it for the bank job? Or revenge for what happened at the trolley station? Both. <laughs> Neither. What is it? He matter? you know what? Dutch is a Gemini. That's all I have to say. He has Gemini has tendencies. Just about everything else I would know. I'm dating one. He also set us up. And lest we forget, took young Jack. I understand. We just got a lot of pots on the boil, given all the folks who's out gunning for us. You all seem to have forgotten how money is made and what it takes to support 20 people. Let alone what it takes to give 20 people a new life overseas. With all due respect, Dutch... That's not your problem. Plan really gonna work out? You tell me, Arthur. Is it... Nope, it's Has not. Oh, look at him. He's pissed. To make a future for us. Without lube, too. But, 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 when did you become so small minded? Dutch, your plans you suck. You always ruin it for us. Ways? Just tell me. Course, look at him gaslighting him man, and manipulating him. I am not forcing anybody to stay. But you are low-key making them dependent of you. Make them incompetent. On purpose. Just so they could depend on you, Dutch. In which we do nothing and get everything. I know. You're right. What? Since when? We are always on borrowed time. The Pinkertons. We need to move. And soon. Haven't I made that clear? I feel like I'm going in circles with all of you. Micah is the only one left with any loyalty. Are you dead ass, Dutch? You Micah? Like John. I swear that woman is poisoning him against me. I've seen it before. Oh man, not the anyway, woman. Here we are. Let me do the talking. Oh, that moon looks so sick against the trees and the clouds like this. Ooh, I love this. The graphics in this game is phenomenal. Oh, Dutch is so Thomas. annoying, though. Hi, Key. It is good to see you, my friend. Hello, Mr. Dutch. Thomas, have you met Arthur? Arthur? Thomas is quite the boatman. He's going to help us get close to our prey. The other night, we had quite the adventure fishing for catfish. Now, my friend... Can I call in that favor? What do you need? You know Angelo Bronte. Well, exactly. We need to make a social call. We were hoping you could row us in quietly one evening around the back of his house. Well, if anyone can, I can. We'll pay you for your trouble. If you're bringing him trouble, it won't be no trouble for me. Oh, he hates him too. My business partner, Jules, he's out on the skiff. I need to check with him. Plus, I need to check the traps. Would you come with me? Of course. Arthur? I mean, do I have a choice? It shouldn't take too long if we can find it. Be lively. Mind it, there's a lot of gators. Uncommon number. Big ones. Great. Gators? Gators? It'll take more than a 
prehistoric reptile to scare you, Shirley. I mean, I have you next to me to do all that. Match when it comes to it. An aging predator with a big mouth, Dutch. Yeah, sounds familiar. Something of a comedian, Thomas, more of a jester than a gunslinger. Well, if you say so, Miss Dutch. This way. Come on, this way. Follow me here. And stay on the high ground. Oh, say less. I'm not so trying to get ground. eaten. Feels like water to me. Down here, we can't be too picky there, Mr. Arthur. I thought you said we're staying in high ground. Yeah, we're going in water. Oh, man. Ew, I'm going in the nasty water. Oh, hell no. Mr. Dutch, you keep a lookout for company? Mr. Arthur, check the traps with me. Oh, great, sure. I'm like balls deep in this dirty water, bro. I'm not even feeling this at all. This one's empty. Alright, I got a few more set over this way. Come on. I don't want to know what just touched my leg. Mr. Dutch, you show you the right fellas to be going after Angelo Brunson? Oh, he's much more the kind of reptile I can handle. How are you so casually going inside this water? You know how much viruses, bacteria, germs that can like eat your flesh in the, these neck of the woods? And then top of that, we got gators watching us too. I hear them. I hear them, little monsters. The night folks. What's that? What you mean? Gets better and better. Hey, how far are we going? Cause we're chest deep and I feel really uncomfortable. I'm scared. I ain't trying to drown. Oh man. Uh Okay. Whoa. High ground. Nice. Stop where you are. What? Gator. Where? Oh, I hear them. Right there. Oh, hell no. We need to leave. I would never live in these neck of the woods. I'm a city slicker, and I'm proud of it. Uh, if it means just so I want to deal with those gators. I don't know what's taking Jewel so long with that boat. I think we are all equally keen to find it. We? Who's we? Since when are we speaking French? We, we. I want to go home. I, you know, it's a good thing I'm wearing this outfit. Just imagine if I was wearing a nicer outfit. I would have been livid. Oh, no, my coat. My coat. It's getting all wet. Oh. stuck in the mud. It happens. Of course. Of course. I'm not even surprised. Oof. It broke. That's why I was stuck. Guess something didn't want to be caught. My God. So it's true. Well, it's Boys. true. There's been talk of a big old bull, but people talk a lot of nonsense. I guess this was... No, but only some huge could do this. Oh, fantastic. Let's hope it bites you first, Dutch. Should we just keep moving? Mm -hmm. I don't really want to hang around here much longer. He ignored me. I, I love it. Wait. Let's go. Where is Jules? Man, this is not... Ugh. Like, I I feel shivers down my spine because, like I said, this is nasty water. Another one? Damn, there's three of them. I wonder what they taste like. I always wanted to try out gator jerky. I've seen it in the stores in the God, New Jersey mall. Good eating. Us or them? Exactly. Come on. I would love to try gator meat with some rice and beans and some tostones and avocado. I know that play would be slamming, honestly. The waters here look like the ones in West Harford. 
No, not West Hartford. West Haven. The West Haven Beach. What? Oh, gosh. Fine. But yeah, I remember one time I went to the beach in West Haven. And the waters are exactly this green. With, like, a touch of brown. Because, you know, the seaweed over there is just so dooky brownish. Oh, man. And I'm all alone. Why is it that we always gotta split up? As if that's, like, the best idea. Why can't we do it in pairs? Dutch by himself and me and the other guy. Two teams. Sounds like a good pair to me. Jules, are you there? Oh my gosh. Hello? Jules. This is Ruth. Hello? Jules? Ruth is here. Let me stop. This is not euphoria. You know, I really don't like the music. It's really giving me uneasy vibes. Especially since I'm trying to make sure the gator doesn't eat my ass. I know I'm a, I'm a big snack, but I'm not trying to be that type of snack, you feel me? Hey, someone there? Jules. Jules? Oh my gosh. Where you at, Jules? This isn't funny. No. How much you want to bet Jules is dead? Dead as hell. And we're just over here wandering around. Wait, I see something. I see a boat. Oh. That must be him. Oh, okay. Hey, you in the tree. What are you doing? There's a monster. A monster. No, don't tell you me. Okay don't tell me. Where? And I'm chest deep into the water. You must be Jules. Yes. Where is the boat? Over there. I ran. I... Oh. Okay. <laughs> and, uh, where'd this monster swim off to? I think that way. Say less. As long as... You'll need a as long as it's over that away and not this away, I'm Gucci either way. I got you! I'm right here, Jules. No worries. I'm right here. Yeah, yeah. I'm just trying to... see how I can get inside this boat. There you go. Stuck! Against this big old branch. There you go. Jump. Good man. All right, let's get back to the dock. Yes, please, let's go. I know I smell musty as hell. I need to take a shower at least twice to get the smell off of me. Thank God. So, uh, who are these fellas, Thomas? Two new friends of mine. I'll explain later. Jules, we are very happy to have finally made your acquaintance. Shut up, oh, Dutch. Be out here all night. What you doing hiding up in the tree, boy? This gator was huge, Thomas. Twice as big as I ever seen. Twice as angry, too. Nonsense. Woo! What the hell was that? I think we what the trip. hell? Yeah, I oh, hell no. Hey. Yeah, just do it. Won't take you a minute, boy. Go on. This is a bad idea. We we'll see any giant monster long before it gets anywhere near you. Got a couple crack gunslingers here with the guns loaded. You yeah. Didn't, you didn't see the thing. Yeah, neither did you. It's just a myth, Jules. Now pull. Can you do it or nah? Oh, boy. Yo, you hear that? Yo! Jules! Shit. He won't kill. No, I'm going in. No, no, we can't lose the boat. Watch the 
jewels? What? What? Shit, you gotta be kidding me. Alright. Come on. Jules, where you at? No, I got you. Don't worry. It's not gonna eat you. Not in front of my salad, it ain't. Shit. Come on, Jules. Hold on a little bit long. Oh, I see that thing. I see that thing. I see. Oh! Oh! Oh, no. Oh, no. I saw that. I saw the water moving. Jules, come on. Where you at? Where you at, Jules? Oh, thank goodness. I got you. I got you. No worries. Shh. Shut up. I got you. Come on. Okay. Come on. How bad are you hurt? Hurry up! What do you mean, don't look behind me? Oh, look at his foot! Stop moving! Stop moving! I'm trying? It's pretty deep, so... Oh, I am getting tired. Come on. Let me see. Dang, look at his leg! Oh, no, look at his leg. Wait, that's it? Oh, hell no! Look at that massive ass gator! No wonder they were tweaking! First of all, I'm gonna need this. Let's go. There you go. There you go. There you go. Oh gosh, it is coming towards us. Hey, yo! Are we good or not? What? Oh my gosh. This is insane. Okay. Yeah, come on. Just thank your old Uncle Dutch. I heard that. <laughs> Alright, let's go, let's go. Come on. I am so sorry that you went through that, but I am happy that you're alive. Okay? That gator's not gonna bother you anymore. There's still a lot of blood. You need to put pressure on it. That's what I'm doing, Dutch. That's what I'm doing. I've stopped the bleeding. I think the boy's okay. passed out, if though. Get a fever. We can bring down a fever. A fever is the least of our worries. Yo, that's him again. That's him again. Hold on, I got this. Got it. Come on. Oh, man. What? What? Ooh. Ooh, I hear him. Okay. I think it's had enough. You sure? Look at him. Wake up. Be okay, kid. Oh. Sorry, Jules. Guess all them stories was true. Big and bad. That's unusual. Normally the little one's angry. Big one's is lazy. Well, I guess he never outgrew his anger. It must be a Gemini to too. You know, I don't think I've ever seen you squeal before, Dutch. <laughs> I weren't the one squeal. Yeah, well, you okay. were in the water with me. And this poor boy was nearly dinner. Can we get some help? Jules has been bitten. Oh my god. There's a monster out here. He's been bitten, but he's alive. Uh, Just keep him warm. Uh, Feed him garlic for the infection. Garlic? Okay, I never heard of that before. I'm at your service anytime you need. Thank you, Thomas. Where can we find you? You just meet me back here. Very good. Can one of you help me put the boat back out? Sure. Of course, I got you. Camp and placate the irritable Miss O'Shea, who's causing more trouble. I'll collect the boys. Meet you back here, Arthur. Mr. Arthur? Yeah. Right there. Bad man. I know. 
kill some good folks. Hurt a lot of people. That's yeah, why you want to be in on this, huh? Sean. I'll see you soon. Be safe. You that too. Tell me about it. That was so crazy. That gator was whew. He looked big and mean. Whew. Honestly, let's go ahead and cook some some food here. I deserve a nice little meal. I'm not gonna lie. Uh, let me see. Should we do the fish? The pork? Ooh. Okay. I say let's do some... Uh, let's do some fish. Look at that. Oh, wow. Can I have a close-up of that? No? No close-up? Okay. Ooh, hell yeah, I'm eating that. I deserve that. Dealing with dealing with that gator last night, I need some emotional compensation. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, let's cook another one. Man, that looks good. Shoot, I could have me a nice little fish fillet at this point. All right, what else are we cooking? I say let's do this one. I want. I wonder what. Wait a minute. You're just gonna cook it like that? No seasoning? Nothing? Come on, Arthur. At least some salt and pepper. Am I right? No. All right. You know what? I say let's go ahead and just craft something. Tonics? I can make this? Oh, that's how you do it. This is this is amazing. This is what I like about Red Dead Redemption 2. It kind of like teaches you how to do stuff. I'm going to stow this one. And I just love how he has a random empty bottle too. And I can make ammo? Wow. Weapons? Alright, I gotta see this. Oh, that's cute. That is so cute. That's all I need. Wow, I can make bait too? Huh. And I can make arrows. This is nice. All right, so I definitely ate a lot of meat. So I know I'm going to get some protein for it. That being said, I say we should take a nice little nap and then we can get, get on with our day from there. Thank you for watching. This is Lover of Ladies, and I'll see you next week.